you may be wondering, how the hell did you get into the VIP exclusive FIFA Awards after party? Well, that's what I'm going to be explaining today, guys. There were pros, there were legends, and I'm telling you how I got in. Okay, so sit back and enjoy the best. I did actually have a ticket to this event. You know, I was in there, in my seat, that was all fine. But I wanted to get to that after party because I knew I could meet some legends, some people that I've been wanting to meet for ages. Now, the problem was, I was on the balcony level, all the legends, all the pros were on the hall level, right down at the bottom. So, that's where I needed to get down to. And that was the mission. Now, before I get on to anything else, I do want to give a little shout out to Fan Movement 7 League for inviting me down, which it was an incredible tournament. And well done to FIFA for hosting a really entertaining and enjoyable event. <laughs> Here's another thing, the best 11 caused some controversy, this guy on screen, Kylian Mbappe made it, and uh, so did Hazard, but Neymar didn't make it, neither did Mo Salah, questionable. Also, Noel Gallagher performed at the event, enjoy this. <laughs> So far. Ronaldinho and Michael Ballack. And then they announced the uh, full 11 best 11 team on stage. And uh, oh, two people are missing. I wonder who that is. As you can see, there are two players that didn't make it. Um, Messi, Ronaldo. Uh, two guys we don't know. However, <laughs> still pretty mad to think I'm that close to some absolute ballers on the football pitch. Best in the world. I'm just. Pro to be uh, next to the player like this, you know, uh, this kind of player. They are all uh, the top guy. player in the world. Um, some of them, they are friends of mine. So yeah, I'm just happy to be here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the relationship between them two. Is Modric. Yes, Modric has won the main trophy, you know, the best of the best award goes to Luka Modric. And well played because he was amazing at the World Cup. He won the Champions League with Real Madrid. He had a great season with Real Madrid and he's just all round just a quality central midfielder. And I'm sure in the future you will have another opportunity to fight for this trophy. Hold on a sec, did Luka Modric just try to crack some banter or... And I'm sure in the future you will have another opportunity to fight for this trophy. The fame's got to him, hasn't it? Top so, the awards has ended and this is when I was meant to go home. But I just so wanted to meet some legends and some footballers and I was committed. I decided to look around. They were telling us to go out the emergency exit, so I knew if I was going to walk down these stairs, I'm going to get to the hall. This is where the after party was. So I decided to go down. So I go down, and this is where I met everyone. At first, I met Casper Schmeichel. Then I met Gerard Houllier. Then I saw Sherla for Fulham. Then I met Balak. <laughs> Oh, there's Shola and Balak just chilling there. Mad. Here is the after party. Loads of legends just chilling around here, like... I'm just walking around, meeting legends. Probably the youngest guy here as well. Diego Forlan, Zanetti, and then... I saw two Chelsea players, current players, going down the stairs. There was an exclusive, exclusive after party going upstairs, and I knew two of legends were coming down. And then I saw them, and I was like, this is my chance. Boom, I 
got a picture with N'Golo Kante. I know he doesn't look happy because he's being escorted out by bodyguards, but he gave me a second. We had a, l a very short little chat. He spoke to me. He was nice to me. And he's, he's been escorted, so he doesn't look happy. And then Eden Hazard as well. Oh, my God. Eden Hazard. It's just crazy to think I was chilling in a party with um, the best players on this planet. So, uh, here's Arsene Wenger having a nice little conversation with Zanetti. I mean, it's just casual, in it? And also, the FIFA president's there as well. It's a bit mad at this event. And then there's Unai Emre, very nice person. Um, Edwin van der Sar, you United fans will love him. Um, then I got, I mean, a, a photo with the legend himself. I'm Wenger in from now on, that's for sure. And Sol Campbell, he, already, he watched my interview. Top lad, really liked him. All right, we're going to walk onto the green carpet, because that's what we're doing. Should be decent. Hopefully there's still some fans at half, at half past midnight. removing everything at this point but i was just taking the piss it was a lot busier and uh when all the celebrities came in and left it was packed full of people show the love on this video by hitting the like button subscribing and we'll do it again i will do it again i promise thank you for watching i want to see you down in the comments uh tell me if you think the best 11 decision was correct and i'll see you all in a bit bye for now